Hey guys, in this video, I will talk about AWS load balancer stickness. So it's possible to implement a stickness so that the same client is always redirected to the same instance behind the load balancer. This works for classic load balancer and application load balancer. The cookie used for stickness has an expiration date you can control. Use case. This uh, feature can make sure that user uh, doesn't lose his session data. Enabling stickness may bring imbalance to the load over the backend EC2 instances. So let's look at this picture. Client A sent two uh, requests, and these two requests will be direct to the same EC2 instance because of the load balancer stickness. Okay, next I will show you how to enable load balancer stickness in AWS. So let's go to the AWS Management Console, and you can see we have two EC2 instances right here. And I have a CLB, which is uh, stand for Classic Load Balancer. So like I said before, the Load Balancer stickiness only works for CLB or ALB. So in my case, I create a CLB, but if you wish, you can also use ALB, okay? So uh, behind this CLB, uh, we have two EC2 instances. So if I send the traffic to the uh, CLB, it, the, tra uh, the request will dispatch randomly to these two instances, okay? So let's copy the DNS name of the CLB, open a new tab, and let's visit. You can see uh, we got a page like this. Uh, remember the, uh, the IP address, if I uh, send the request again, it may change because our traffic will dynamically distributed to the instances behind the CLB. Okay, next uh, I will show you the effect of the load balancer stickiness. So you can see that if I scroll down, I can see there is a, a configuration for the stickiness, which is called uh, uh, edit stickiness, right? Um, currently the stickiness is disabled, so I can click this button to edit. So in this case, I will choose the second one, and I can set the expiration period. For example, I want it. Uh, I want it to be sixty uh, seconds. Okay, and I click save. Okay, now let's go to the tab again, and let's remember this IP address. So let's send the request multiple times. So as you can see, our traffic, our visit always be sent to a specific EC2 instance, right? Because we enable the load balancer stickiness. And please remember, the um, period, the expression period will be one minute. So after one minute, the load balancer will uh, distribute our traffic uh, dynamically again, okay? So that's all uh, about uh, the load balancer stickiness. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.